Hello and welcome back to another video by Heliguy. In this video we're going to be taking a look at the DJI Smart Controller. The DJI Smart Controller is designed to maximise your outdoor flying experience with the DJI Mavic 2 range or other aircraft equipped with OcuSync 2.0. The Smart Controller has a 5.5 inch built-in screen display and it displays crystal clear images even with the most challenging light environments. Now one thing I think the video doesn't really give it credit to is how bright that screen is. Once you're in direct sunlight you can still see the details on the screen and it is absolutely fantastic and you really need to see it to believe. The device is extremely portable and has detachable control sticks to fit into bags, pouches and also rucksacks. So let's have a look at the specs for this device. It has a 500mAh battery that supports quick charging and can work continuously for two and a half hours. It's also suitable for stable operation in temperatures from minus 20 right up to 40 Celsius, giving you a reliable HD connection so you can go further. Another great feature of this controller is that it has a screen built in, meaning you don't need to bring a phone with you or an iPad to connect to it. The controller also has a built-in microphone and speaker meaning you can edit videos on the device and play them back and hear all the audio. The DJI Smart Controller is a customised Android system and optimised for DJI Go 4's app. This ensures that it's more focused and faster for aerial creation work. The Smart Controller also supports third-party apps for a variety of additional sharing and editing options. Now one thing that I really like about this controller is the size of it, and it is bigger than the controller that comes in the box, however this allows you to get a good grip onto the controller and use its full functionality. The button placements are really ergonomic where they've been put and fit exactly into the palm of your hand. The touch screen on the smart controller as well is very responsive, and I was actually surprised to have this on a controller like this. The controller is easy to set up and has loads of features to help you get flying, and I definitely recommend it for beginners to professionals wanting to take their equipment to the next level. Thanks for watching this video, don't forget to subscribe for more content like this and hit the like button. And if you have any questions about this product or questions about drones in general, just put them in the comments below and we'll get back to you. Thanks for watching, see you in the next one.